Dynamark, get ready, he's it, go. Dark. Kelly's here. Wow. Kelly's here. Perfect. Gaming. That's amazing. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. I'm Gilly. And I'm Zelly. And we're giving here today is Yori Fuyusaka once again. <laughs> She's kind of bland. The story's kind of simple. We're moving forward. So right now, we went to go see A. Once. Twice. Will it be a thrice? We'll find out, I guess. Huh? Kelly? Yes, we will. Miko's taking a while. She said she had some papers to deliver, right? To the art room, I think? Yeah. Mm. Jeez, or Yori, she, 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 does, did she just sound kind of depressed? She's like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's like, oh, I saw A again, but then he sent me back to my own time again. Maybe this is something else has happened right now, but we're not aware of it as the audience. You know? What's up, Yori? You look bummed. Huh? I I'm fine. I just can't believe A has romance for another person. We're going to Tsutsuji today, right? Miwako did say she wanted to stop by the record store. She wants that new Idol album, right? There she is. Huh. Sorry to keep you waiting. Miwako is my favorite. She's you know the MVP. What? I saw Natsuno-chan just She's now. She's the queen but, of this hey, game. the bus mm -hmm. is here. There's a bus? Is Fluffy nearby? Save it for later. Wait oh. for us! Okay. Hey yo, I say hey yo. You know, I just love Miwa Chan as a character and herself. I just love her to pieces. She's so cute. I know, right? She's very it's different from the down. other gals. It's because you were waiting on me. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry, Miwa Chan. We couldn't even get the record you wanted. I can't believe all three stores were sold out. Well, yeah, if she's that popular. Yes. It's getting kind of late. You know, once you're big, reward. it's uh. Maybe I should call home. Go big or go There's home. There's a phone yeah. over there. Right. Maybe A's inside. Maybe I can give him a call. Maybe I can convince him otherwise that Ryoko's not the one for him. Hi, Dad. It's me. Uh huh. <laughs> That's it? What? Wow. <sighs> Who talks to their parents like that? I don't know. How, how can you garner anything out of that unless it's just like, yo, know, you need to be picked up? Uh-huh. Hey, Dad, it's me. Are you alive? Pretty uh -huh. much how I thought. He wants me to come home ASAP. Uh -huh. Figures. The train's probably fastest. Eh. Uh, I could walk. I'll be fine alone in the dark by my lonesome. What's wrong? Is it men in black? Oh. Who is that punk that uh, Neji's always that fighting? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's the bully from before. I thought so. Pompadour dude? What about him? <laughs> I think it was last week. He was harassing us by the school gate. You got harassed? Dude, everything okay? Luckily, Neji. That seems like such, a, such a guy response. He. He did? Oh my god! Kisaragi's blushing, I think. What now? Oh, dang, that's kind of hot. The other way? That'd be best. Like, what a man. Am I right, Kelly? I guess. What a man. Is there someone in this direction? Uh, what oh. school are you from? Didn't they tell you not to roam around after dark? What um, the F? Who's this geezer? I'm Hazo Onishi. Police force. Juvenile division. Uh-oh. You may know me better as Onishi the Ogre. He's gonna take us into custody. We're just trying to get home. Why does this have, have to be so complicated? <laughs> if there's anybody he should be looking into is the bully on the other side. Yeah, no kidding. From the uniform, you're from Sakura High. It's eight o'clock. What are you doing out at this hour? Um, well, we were shopping for a record and it got dark before we knew it. It's true. That's true. It's dangerous for young girls like you to be out on the streets at night. The reason doesn't matter. We're sorry. If it happens again, I'll write you up. Now hurry on home. Thank you, sir. Let me go. Now what? Oh, they're here too. Is it Nenji? Oh, it's his bull his bully brigade. These guys are his buddies, right? Oh, come on. We're cornered, we're pictured, Kelly. What do we do? Do we divide and conquer? Do we just scatter? What do we do, Yuri-chan? 
Uh, Do we have Denji's number? Kisiragi. Do you have Denji's number? Let's make a break right. for the station. So what, the other way? I guess. Uh, well, well. Oh. So we meet again. You've done it now. Come with me. I'll show you a good time. I know the perfect place. Wajima. <laughs> oh. Oh, the ogre. Don't tell me. You're up to no good again. I knew I've it. I done anything. Yet. Yet. <laughs> Run along home. Or would you rather come with me? Ah, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. See? Now can we go home? Let's talk to him. Just hurry up and go home. Wow. Cool. What great... Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> what a great role model he is, you know? Downtown back alley. I kind of want to be like him when we grow up. What? How? He ambushed us in front of the station and forced us into this creepy alleyway. Don't think you'll get away with this. The police are on their way. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Wajima-san has something to say. So listen up, will ya? Hey, knock it off. <laughs> You know, all my life I've been shit out of luck when it comes to women. Until now. Mm. I'm telling you, girl. The moment I saw you, I knew you'd be mine. Okay, that's creepy. <laughs> Get it, Wajima-san? No. Oh, my Thank God. you. I consider myself a man who minds his own business. <gasps> but I can't abide by this. <laughs> you need to leave those girls alone. Yes, please. Get out of here. Now. Who the hell are you? Another poser, huh? <sighs> Hard of hearing, are we? Don't say I didn't warn you. It's you. You better not be messing around. Uh-oh. Oh, no. And then she fights him. She punches in the dark. My toe! Oh, damn it! Man, he's gonna beat up in every time. Boxer. A tad rusty. You got a few hits in. Where? You're like totally unfazed. Um, thank you, but why? Uh, mere coincidence. You're lying. Uh, they must have heard the commotion. It's the cops. <sighs> Quick run. Thank you for beating them so Is they can't okay? move. Care to explain what happened here, Wajima? <laughs> I feel much better with the policeman here. Thanks, Usami-chan. You should have just bolted past the ticket gate. You're such a slowpoke, I'm sorry. Anyway, how'd you get out of this mess? A really cool guy came in and saved us. <laughs> and then he ran away! You mean the one who ran downtown? Probably. Yes, that's right. I wonder what school he goes to. School from, you know, Future Avenue mm -hmm. and Future Street. Well, I'm glad you're okay. We can leave the rest to the cop. Let's go home. <sighs> what should I do? I don't know. I Good wonder guy? where he is now. I might never see him again. Uh oh! <gasps> after him, Kelly! Run after him! Don't Mush! After him. I know I'll regret it. That's Even right. He turns me down. I yeah. have to tell him how I feel. That's right, girl. Sorry, guys. You got this. You tell him right now. Oh, I'm so glad I did that. It has to be him. Uh oh. He's nearby. Uh oh. What? Why? A black suit followed us. Come on. No. I want to confess my feelings to Eddie. He's not gonna like that. He won't fall for us Where then. Where did he go? We gotta butter him up, Kelly. How do we butter up A? Look, it's the drunk people on the bench again. Do we give him a gun? I yeah. swear these guys must party every night. I know. I mean, who puts ties in their foreheads, right? Is it the end of the week? Is it a Friday? <laughs> it's a Japanese anime kind of thing. It's gotta be a Friday, I bet. You know, end of the work week, right? He has to be somewhere. Is he hiding? Is he like fluffy? <sighs> oh, there oh, he's he is. right there. I have to go talk to him. Hey, um. Huh? Oh. Oh my God! It looked um, like him exactly sorry. from behind. Or someone else. It, it's uh. true. Oh my God! Seriously. Oh my God! Wow, that backside. There's multiple A's. I can't find him. That's not good. Come on, use your resource. Oh, men in black. Back there. <sighs> Is 
he's oh. gone. No, he's in the phone booth, that's right. Oh, my hero. There you are. You? Were you following me? Um, I wanted to tell you something. Don't. If you're seen with me, the men in black suits will go after you too. Black suits? I'm being hunted. Do you get it? Now go home, all right? Oh, wait. That's a very quick way to say that without actually getting in trouble, so that's nice. I've got you now. Oh Damn my it. god. Let go of me. Don't even think of drawing your gun here. Watch this. <laughs> oh, she tackled him? Reckless. Look out. <laughs> You're not getting away, Sekigahara. Oh my god. Just run. Forget about me. Is this girl with you? No. The hell's going on here? Perfect timing. Give me a hand. So women and children are fair game, huh? Woo. I don't stand for that, buddy. This is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, my bike. Over here. Quick, high five. Let's go for a ride. Get on. Yes. Oh. Ride me. Get on my bike. Ride me. Sweet. That girl. She seemed to be associated with the men in black. Did you recognize her? No, it was too dark. It was too dark? I see. What? You might want to hold on a little tighter. You're going to fall. She's lying. Uh, okay. Where do you live? It's now or never. Hey, um, I know this is sudden, but I need to tell you, I, I love you. What's this all of a sudden? Some kind of prank from this era? It's not a prank! I know you already have Shinonome Senpai. It's probably awkward to hear this from me, but even if it ends up breaking my heart, I just needed to tell you. Oh. I needed you to know how I feel. <sighs> there seems to be a misunderstanding. Ryoko san is not my girlfriend. Huh? I spent a lot of time alone back home. Parents weren't around, so she stepped in. Looked after me like a big sister. She's family to me. In that sense, I do care for her. I want her to be happy. That's all. You mean it? Middle school was a rough time for me. Haven't heard a thing about love since I was a kid. Until now, that is. <laughs> so she's not his girlfriend after all. You know, I still have a chance. It seems the two of us are bound by fate. What would you do if I told you I'm an assassin from the future who came here to kill you? It wouldn't matter. I would still love you. A guy whose name you don't even know? Well, yeah. <laughs> you feel that strongly, huh? <laughs> Didn't see that coming. <laughs> My name is A. Sekigahara. A. Sekigahara. So, um, I haven't heard a no. <laughs> <laughs> He's just smirking. you home. Don't follow me again, all right? I'll be in touch. Can you, at least, assassin. can you at least spend the night? I really want to get to know you better, eh? I know. <laughs> Why don't we go play hooky together? In my room. Oh. Oh. Hey, we can lock that one, actually. Let's go again. Yori, 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 Yori. Mori Yori. Isn't she fun? I know, right? So chill. Mmm. Hiyaki Cho Shopping District. Shall okay. we get a bite to eat? So we're back at this again. Uh, yeah, oh, good idea. Eating more food, girls? Oh, dude. Uh, why not have the whole menu? First, you helped me look for that record. Now this. I feel like you've been extra nice to me lately. Oh, come on. Don't overthink it. I just figured, you know, you know all the best places to go. Yeah. Hmm. Are you sure? Are you sure it's okay for me to decide? Yes. Uh, of course. In that case... You have the power, Miyoko. Do you want to just talk to, to Tomi? Are you cool with that, Iori? Yes. Is that okay? I'm not hungry? No. What? We're always hungry. Sure. What do you feel like today, Miyoko? We must always stuff our faces, Kelly. We're about to find out. Ooh. 
an adventure today. What will we eat today? A knuckle sandwich. That's a good one. Come on. I thought of it for a second here. Ooh, what is that? It looks like, um, shish kebabs. Was that an izakaya? I thought those places didn't open till late. They don't, but you can still order yakitori for takeout. Yakitori. I've been wanting to try it forever. That's a new one I haven't heard of before. It does look good. It so just good. looks like shish kebabs with meat and veggies on it. Yeah, these girls have some big bites, don't you Whoa, think? Oh, you're right. I know they're hungry, aren't they? Two bites and everything's gone. And char just right. What is this? A festival? Feels weird to walk around with this. <laughs> you're right. People are giving us looks. They say high school girls can get away with anything, but this is embarrassing. <laughs> just oh, please. Try a bite, Sami Chan. <sighs> Won't kill you. Mm. Whoa, that is good. Mm. I love the sauce. You so know, everybody else. Fun fact about Japan is they don't have very many like trash or recycling units like out about on the street. So most of the times when you go out to buy food like off the street, They'll eat it right in front of the vendor stall and just then dispose of their trash right there. Is there a trash bin at their at the vendor? Mm-hmm. Take care of the trash? Okay. Yeah, because that's how Japan <clears throat> keeps their city streets so clean. Is it's considered rude or inappropriate to like eat food while you're walking. So lots of people just buy their food from where they get it from the vendor or the store or whatever, eat it there and then just dispose dispose of their trash right there. Wow, not like Americans where we have bites on the go, we drive with food, and then we also try to have energy drinks and things and munch and stuff on our face as we're doing anything and everything in the world? Yep. Whoa. Just a fun fact. Fun fact with Kelly. Well then, now that that's taken care of, do you have something to tell us, Iori-chan? Huh? Don't think we can't tell. <laughs> What are you guys talking about? Come on, spill the beans. Oh, yeah. We were friends, Yuri chan. <laughs> oh, are man. Are you not going to tell us what happened with your crush? Ooh. We have a right to know. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe because I was piped now. Did you ever get his name? Don't tell me. You just ran up to him and confessed. Uh, <laughs> pretty much. I literally just did. That's exactly what happened. His name is A. Sekigahara. Sekigahara? Of all people, you know him, Usami-chan? Well, uh, let's just say you should stay away from that guy. Why? He's not a normal high school kid. He's involved in some shady business. <sighs> okay. Or maybe it's, uh, misunderstood. I... I know our ways of life are worlds apart. Uh, it may be dangerous. It may be stupid, but I can't stop how I feel. Yuri. There he oh is! My god. Saka. Oh my god. Sekigahara-kun. Come with me. What? But... You. What do you want with Yori? Tell me, Kisaragi. There's oh no time to god. explain. Just come. Please, Fuyusaka. <sighs> Iori-chan. Go! <laughs> go! <laughs> 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 to go, then go! Right. <gasps> that handshake with the Miwa-chan. Go! Go! <laughs> Follow your dreams, follow your love, your passion, your desire. Do you still have those dreams? Huh? The premonitions you told me about. Yes. They're not actually premonitions. They're the memories of Chihiro Morimura. Our I teacher. knew it. You received them in a memory transplant. <sighs> no way. Future technology does have that capability. You mean Miss Morimura is from the future? Correct. Just as you saw in your dreams. If that's true, are Amiguchi-kun and Karabe-kun the same? Karabe? You're acquainted with Tamao-san? Tamao? No, I meant Juro Karabe from my class. Juro, so that's it. Why did I have a memory transplant? If I had to guess, no. It's better you hear it from her directly. From Miss Morimura? We'll be seeing her soon. Oh, yeah? I was hired to kill you. Want to see how I kill you? <laughs> the other you? Kill you with love. She's at the park? Hey, wait! Is he gonna be like the little kid? 
Looks like we got here first. Let's wait here. Hmm. What is it? Um, hey, Sekigahara-kun, would you mind if I called you Akun? If that's what you want. <laughs> Just a mouthful to keep saying. Ace Gahara. What's wrong? Taking pills again, are we? Taking pills. You gotta take those pills. Kelly's pills are good for you. Are you okay? You know, I grew up just like you, right here in Ashitaba City. Well, 80 years into the future, that is. You saw it, right? It'll happen here any day now. Just as you saw in your dreams, this town will come under attack by the Daimos. If those dreams were Miss Morimura's memories, that's why you both came here, right? To fight the Kaiju. Not Morimura. Not anymore. At this point, it's up to us. Us? The compatible ones. Those capable of altering this world. You're one of them. But this world is beyond saving. Huh? Would you like to come with me? We can go back 16 years and try again. The city may go down, but it won't take us with it. 16 more years should be enough time to prepare. We'll win next time. Hmm. I don't know. What about Miwa-chan? And so are my parents. They'll be attacked by the Daimos, and that'll be it. But your parents aren't real. <gasps> Chihiro Morimura came here from Sector 1. You are no different. <laughs> oh, come on. They're my family. If you decide to stay here, you'll perish along with them. Maybe that's best. Choice. In that case, I'll do it. Just like in my dreams, I'll fight and protect everyone. And how do you plan on doing that? Um. Not sure. Don't have a plan yet, but... There's the thought that counts. 2089. That's what year it was in my dream. He said he'd gone back in time 16 years to find me. If that was a real premonition, something's gonna happen in the year 2105. That's 120 years from now. Yeah. Juro has no memory of what happened, but I expect you'll have his help. You mean Kurabi-kun? What about you? Won't you be fighting too? Ryoko-san and I... We don't have much time left. I can't afford to stay around. Oh. That's the kind of guy I am. I don't deserve your love. Do you get it now? <laughs> Do ya? Akun. Um. Well. You know what? I'll go check if Miss Morimura is here yet. Yeah? Is something gonna change when we come back? Nope, it's still the same. Oh, here she is. Fuyusaka-san. She looks just like in my dream. Explain. Why did you bring her here? To expose your secrets. She has a right to know. Miss Morimura. Hmm. Go on. Tell her. <sighs> Ooh. Is it true? Are my dreams really your memories? <laughs> Why would you do such a thing? If you're not gonna talk, I'll do it. You wanted to write your memories and personality onto Fuyusaka, right? So you could someday take over. What? She was trying to assume your identity. Fine, I'll explain. That was my intention, but things have changed. Oh? Operation Aegis is all we have left. So then... What's going to happen to me? Well, I hadn't gotten to the final step. You'll continue on as Iori Fuyusaka. You do carry my memories within you. But even that process was left incomplete. Juro made sure of it. Thanks to him, my memories are nothing but dreams to you. You mean... the Kurabe-kun I saw in my dreams? 426. Did you perform a memory transplant on him, too? No. I have nothing to do with his current state. If it were up to me, I would have changed him back into the old Izumi-kun. Oh, your memories just hit me. I understand how you feel. <sighs> Is that why you transplanted the memories of Tamao Kurabe? It can't be. Tell me your real objective. She 
She's not lying about her feelings. I can tell. Yes, I transplanted memories into Tamao Kurabe and Shu Amiguchi. I had to deliver on a promise I made. But there has to be a reason they were compatible. That's what I need to know. That's why I called you here. <sighs> tell me. Mm. The truth is, I am no longer human. <sighs> When the reset occurred, the world that I was in was taken over. At that time, the real me died. Then what are you now? An illusion produced by universal control. That's all that's left of me. Wow. You're an illusion? <laughs> How did that happen? Isn't Sector Zero supposed to prevent that? Going there allows you to escape to the next world. The concept of living through a reset is something of a misunderstanding. In short, it's not possible. Sector Zero is unique. Going there is not akin to a typical sector shift. Instead, it scanned me in as data. And with that data, Universal Control did its work. It created a perfect replica of me in the next world. So that's what a loop really is. Hmm. There are 15 humans capable of carrying out the plan. What plan? The plan made in the year 2188 to continue the species. But I'm no longer a part. I'm nothing but a doll held captive in the five sectors. I'm incapable of fulfilling my mission. So you turn to the version of you who was born into this world, Iori Fuyusaka. In time, she and you would be one and the same. That's how you plan to reclaim your humanity. Seki Gohara-kun, I gather you intended to make use of Sector Zero as well. You would be correct. And you planned to put a stop to Operation Aegis, didn't you? Yes. By killing you. Huh? Are you going to shoot me right here and now? Mm. You can't do that! <gasps> if Operation Aegis were put into motion, this world would be cut off from universal control. What would become of you then? Data stored in Sector Zero can function independently of UC. In other words, you'll continue to live, human or not. So that's the way it is. Ryoko-san and I, we never had a way out in the first place. Hmm. Yeah, that's feeling pretty shitty. Aww. Oh. Oh my god, there's three? There's three in the same place. It's gonna be weird. Hey, Kun, I'll protect you. Let's do this together. If only I had the courage to take your hand. That would have been for the best. <laughs> oh, man. I repeat. We interrupt this program to bring you an important emergency broadcast. Okay. A large unidentified object has crash landed in the city. It is headed north toward Kasumicho, destroying everything in its path. A state of emergency has been declared in Ashitaba City. The neighboring three wards are advised to evacuate immediately. Wow. It really came. The day of the attack. Only one thing left to do. Hmm. A Time to activate. Time. His last words to me. What? Did A die? Wait. Did A disappear? A kun wait. First you show up at school all of a sudden, and then you pull me away to a place like this. Stay still. Huh? Smooth? What? Um. Uh, um. I'm not ready for this. <laughs> Found it. Odd place to be shot. Whoa. What is that? An activation switch. It's used to call your sentinel. Don't move. That should do it. If what 426 said is true, that's all I need to do. I registered my sentinel. Sentinel number 15. It's a robot used to fight the Daimos. It was mine. But it's in better hands with you. Oh. I really was worthless in the end. Don't say that. Fuyusaka, I... Huh? Never mind. It's nothing. Just forget what Morimura said, all right? Believe in yourself. <laughs> Come on, guys aren't gonna kiss or nothing. I oh. swear, in this series. No, 
Why to ship so many couples? You can't just run off like that. Just as Akun said, I'm going to believe in myself now. Mom, Dad, Miwa-chan and the rest. I can do it. I can protect you all. It's time. I may be just a schoolgirl, but now I'm a schoolgirl <laughs> with a giant robot. I'm a schoolgirl <laughs> with a giant robot. That's right. Let's punch some faces. Let's punch some mechs. Let's go. <laughs> she lifted her skirt a little bit. You want to see what's up here, boys? Too bad. I'm going to be a giant mech. I'm going to punch some giant robots in the face. Are you killing? Sure. <laughs> To the final battle. The final battle already? Did we complete hers? We did complete hers. Wow! I thought for Boom. sure we'd have another story to go through at least. I know. I felt like Jerus was a lot more in depth. I thought, yeah, right? For Versus sure. Yoris. I mean, we learned some things from that, but I mean, I don't know. Yoris, Morimura. There was three verses of Morimura in the same location. I know that was trippy, right? Uh, oh my god! All right. Well, I've been Kelly. I've been Zelly. <laughs> Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. bye. Okay. That was different. I made it rhyme if you didn't tell. Mm -hmm. like, what you say? Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. See how it rhymed? <laughs> no, the way I phrased it does rhyme. Yours, I'm not sure if it does rhyme. Say it again. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Time and subscribe? You think rhymes? Th doesn't it sound similar? Sort of, but I don't <laughs> think it does, Kelly. I just wanted to try it, okay? I like it, dear. I like your chances, though. I like it when you try. Hey, Kelly, they stayed to the end. I know, Zelly. I think they like us. Like, like subscribe, or share, share to show us you care. Bye-bye.